common English questions. How many languages do you speak? I speak one languages. I speak two languages, English and Spanish. I can speak three languages, English, French, and German. I am fluent in four languages, English, Mandarin, Arabic, and Italian. Can you speak English? Yes, I can speak English very well. No, I don't speak English. A little bit. I can understand some English. Yes. I can speak English fluently. I am learning English, but I am not fluent yet. Are you learning English? Yes, I am currently learning English. Absolutely. I am actively studying English. Yes. I am in the process of learning English. How long have you been learning English? I have been learning English for two years. I started learning English six months ago. I have been studying English for five years. Why do you study English? I study English to improve my communication skills. I learn English to increase my job prospects. I study English because I love learning new languages. How did you learn English? I took classes for three years. I did an intensive course. I've been studying by myself. I picked it up from movies and songs. My friend taught me. Which grade are you in English? I am in the intermediate level in English. I am currently at an advanced level in English. I am in the beginner's level in English. What do you want to do after you graduate? After I graduate, I want to pursue a career in international relations. I plan to continue studying for a master's degree after graduation. I am interested in finding a job in the finance industry after graduation. What's your favorite subject in English? My favorite subject in English is literature. I enjoy studying grammar and vocabulary. I find speaking and conversation practice to be my favorite subject in English. Do you have any exams coming up? Yes. I have an English exam next week. I am preparing for a speaking test in English. No, I recently completed my English exams. Is English difficult? Yes, English can be challenging, but with practice, it gets easier. English has its complexities. But it's manageable with dedication. Yes, learning English can be difficult, especially pronunciation and grammar. What challenges do you face in learning English? I find it difficult to remember new vocabulary words. I struggle with understanding fast-paced native English speakers. I sometimes have trouble with grammar rules. Do you advise me to learn English? Yes, I highly recommend learning English as it opens up many opportunities. Absolutely.
Learning English will greatly benefit you in the long run. Yes, I advise you to learn English as it is a widely spoken language globally. How often do you practice speaking English? I try to practice speaking English every day. I have conversations with my English speaking friends twice a week. I participate in an English conversation club once a month. What resources do you use to learn English? I use online language learning platforms. I watch English tutorial videos on YouTube. I read English books and articles to improve my vocabulary. How do you improve your English pronunciation? I listen to English songs and repeat the lyrics. I practice pronunciation exercises with a language partner. I use pronunciation apps to help me with specific sounds. How do you practice English writing? I write daily journal entries in English. I participate in online writing forums and receive feedback. I practice writing essays and short stories in English. Do you watch English movies or TV shows with subtitles? Yes, I watch English movies with English subtitles to improve my listening skills. Sometimes I watch them with subtitles in my native language for better understanding. No, I prefer watching without subtitles to challenge myself. How do you expand your English vocabulary? I use flashcards to learn new words and review them regularly. I read English books and underline unfamiliar words to look up later. I use vocabulary building apps and websites to learn new words. Have you ever traveled to an English speaking country to practice your language skills? Yes, I spent a month in the United States to immerse myself in English. No, but I plan to visit an English speaking country in the future to practice. No, I haven't had the opportunity to travel yet. The end. Hope you have enjoyed the reading. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And find more fascinating and exciting stories from the description below the video.